I'm just going to go ahead and walk through uh, again doing the uh, programming the codes in case you uh, need to do to program the remote control codes. So I will hold this button down for a second. Um, this red LED flashes now it's on so it's waiting for codes to be sent so I just have to push through the buttons in order it flashes a confirmation then it waits for the next one so in case I you know I don't see the confirmation or it, uh, I accidentally press the button twice it I won't see it wait so you gotta watch and make sure that like just then I got I got two uh, presses for the six, so um, I'm just going to hold this down, cancel it out, and start again. Um, I got to press the button twice there before it got the code. It's a lot easier to do when you're not talking. Uh, And tends the last button, and now it flashes a save to EEPROM, and that completes the uh, remote code programming and setup. So, um, so the the lights flashing right now, indicating we're in manual mode. So, as a uh, demonstrate that, I can run the actuator in a south direction, which typical setup that would be for the elevation. It would move at a uh, extend the arm, so that's how you've got to wire it up. So there's the extension. Uh, I can press stop. Notice how it keeps running. I don't have to hold the button down. Um, when it, once I press the direction, it'll, it'll run for a, I believe it's 15 seconds uh, uh, before stopping automatically. Or we can uh, just press the uh, the stop button Yeah, when, it, when it's at the position we want to stop at. And likewise, I can run the uh, east motor. Um, I don't have to press stop. I can just reverse direction if I want to. Um, whoa, stop. Now it doesn't look like I got that uh, stop button programmed in there correctly. Um, so we're going to walk through this code setup again here. All right. So one, two. All right, let's try this again here now. That's better. Okay, so I can run the motors each direction, stop it. Um, we're in manual tracking, we're going to put it back into auto track and we should get another tracking update. I'll just move the uh, light a little bit here before I do to make sure. And so now we're back in auto. Once track, uh, spinning the up. 